would be crazy, you can see I don't really. But let's talk about what you say with your fashion sense. What exactly is it that you do? Are you a suburban housewife? No, no. I'm a professional. Are you a realtor? Is this your uniform that you're wearing right now? No. Oh, I'm I... so sorry. I apologize. I just saw that you, you, you sort of look like you're in uniform. Anyway, getting back to the topic. Well, I would love to be in a fashion magazine, but I don't think the makeover part of it is appealing to me. Because you're not really going to take me from A to A. <laughs> I'm already at A. Um, being the highest mark. No, I don't think you're at A. Actually, I really, we need to, a makeover involves a before and an after. That's my point. There's no before to shoot. All I see right now is before. So I just want to turn you from a suburbanite into a glamorous, sophisticated, and sexy woman. I'm well, sure it's in there. I don't, I guess our eyes are. I have a big team. And I know, Fiona, that you are trying very hard, but it's just not cutting it. What, what, what exactly is not cutting it? The striking, powerful statement of red? Or the finely tailored blazer? What part of it's not cutting no, it? None of it is. Actually, none of it is working. The over bleached hair, the wrong shade of red, the boxy fit of your jacket. It's just giving me an, it's, it's giving me very mall. Do you shop at the mall? Where are you actually? I'm in Philadelphia. Have you ever been to New York, Fiona? I'm frequently in New York. I have a penthouse apartment in New York. So next time in the, you're in New York, we will schedule you to come by the office. Mm -hmm. We will, I can pull some samples together you're not sample size, but we'll have a seamstress there that can do the fittings. But yes. I'll call some of my designer friends. Oh. And trust me, there will be a an enormous improvement. Oh, well, that's wonderful. And how quickly can you lose 10 pounds?